Alright guys, hello and welcome back to Let's Play Uncharted 2 The Among Thieves. Now unfortunately, I have finished this game. I finished it about 15 minutes ago. But, it didn't record the game sound. So I've got to do... Are you kidding me? I can't select chapters! Alright. So, the thing that I have uh, got to do is all these chapters again. All the way to this one. So I've got to do 24. Really aggravating, but I've already done. I've, I've done two. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, two, twenty-three, twenty-three. All right. Well, without further ado, let's get straight on to it, shall we? So we what we will be doing? Uh, probably this one and one and getting as much done as we can and then we'll be going on to um, warfare tomorrow let's not waste time let's get on to it yeah we'll save it again why not i just want to get this done and if I get these two chapters done, I'm then two chapters ahead. I actually want to go to bed. I do want to go to bed. <coughs> I'm, pretty sure, I'm pretty sure I want to go to bed. Okay, I've planted charges all around the perimeter of the camp. You two just need to arm them. The first one should be right ahead of you. Here it is. I also left the detonator for you. Uh huh. All right. First one set. Don't touch the button. This one? <laughs> Once you've set all the charges, just hit the detonator and it's showtime. <laughs> just be careful. Lazarevich has got his men posted all around the perimeter. Keep an eye out for patrols. Sweating like a hooker in church. You brought a hooker to church? Why not? <clears throat> How much longer do we have to stay in this stinking swamp? Hey, Till Lazarevich careful. finds what he's looking for. Don't tell him. I don't know what I'm doing. Heads up! Ah, perfect. Thanks, kid. This way. Yeah. Nate, you should be approaching excavation site one by now. They should have been back by now. Shit, we've been spotted. Take them out fast. We can't let them send them back to town. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> you should be getting close to the first camp. A 
planted four more charges in there, but you're going to have to clear the place out before you can arm them. There's nothing out here. Oh, I so want to fucking skip all this shit, but I can't. Here's the camp. You ready for this? Let's do it. Got our arms free of the charges. Sully, shut up, please. Just what I need. There should be only two left. All right, one more, and we're out of here. I don't know where it is. Move, Sully! God, I I away constantly. Nate, we've still got to arm the explosives, remember? Oh, it's over there, isn't it? Sully, shut up. <clears throat> okay, that's all of them. Now, let's go pay Mr. Lazar. Can't reach us. Come on over here. I'll give you a boost. All right. Come on, gorgeous. Jump up. Yep. Uh, uh, you got a great ass, Sully. Uh, thanks. There you go, kid. Uh, All right. Ooh, that must have been some way to walk the ship so far inland. Pop is down again. Ah, uh, the damn thing is always breaking down. Come on, let's just fix it so we can get out of here. Look, they're not armed. Well, not that many. What are we waiting for? We can take these guys. I don't know, Sly. Maybe. Uh! Oh! Always follow the hose. 
Just like in Montreal, huh? You're never gonna forget that, are you? There we go. Cut the four. I think I see the camp up ahead. Okay, you ready? Wait, wait, just hold on a sec. Three months, and you have found nothing. Well, well, well now, wait, wait a minute. We've been... Commander! That must be Lazarevich. This man was caught stealing artifacts from site number five. <laughs> you would betray me for this? No, no, Zoran, I can't explain. No, no need, no need. Uh, uh, I am surrounded by traitors and fools! What do you say we really ruined this guy's day? Do it. Run out! Search the perimeter! Go! All right, it's all yours, kid. I'll cover you from here. I'm like on the side. Some fool left a sniper rifle up here. Careful, mate. Looks like they left a couple of sentries behind. Okay, kid. It's showtime. I'm not saying that's enough of this shit. Lazarevich guy isn't screwing around, Sully. You should see all this stuff. He's got files on every expedition to find Shambhala. All the way back to the 1600s. What about Marco Polo's journals? <laughs> Here they are. Just hurry it up. You haven't got much time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The worthy pilgrim is granted a golden passport to conquer obstacles on his journey to Shambhala. Huh. Is that supposed to mean something? It's me. Hold on. Here we go. It was with great sorrow that I left my fellow travelers to their fate. A fate decreed by the dreadful cargo we bore from Shambhala. You must have thought that tsunami was some kind of divine retribution. Wait a minute. Damn. Sully, I don't think the Chintamani Stone is here. What? Listen to this. I, I would have sooner endured the wrath of Kublai Khan himself than remove the Chintamani Stone from that sacred shrine. Marco Polo never had the stone. Then what dreadful cargo is he talking about? I don't know. Well, if the stone's not here, what the hell is Lazarovich looking for? Shambhala. Here in Borneo? He's a little wide of the mark, don't you think? He must be trying to pick up Marco Polo's trail back to Shambhala. Why? <laughs> because the stone is still there. <sighs> Chloe, can you talk? Hold on. Yeah, I'm here. In all this digging they've done, have they found any bodies, any remains at all? No, now that you mention it, nothing. Why? <laughs> Over 600 people were shipwrecked here, yet there's no bodies. Don't you find that a little odd? So where did they all go? Where would you go if a tsunami hit? To higher ground. Bingo. We head to that mountain. What do you bet we find Marco's pals? Chloe, can you meet up with us? Already on my way. Great. Uh-oh. Nate, you gotta get out of there. You're gonna have to give me a minute, Sully. You don't have a minute. What's he? They're all dead. Oh, crap. Spread out. Stay down, kid. I got you covered. Nate. You. Well, that's yeah, I know cool. about grenades. Is that...
Yeah, I think getting most of these probably is going to be not is be pretty decent. Uh, do we want this one on one shot kills? Yeah, you know what? Fuck it, let's put it on. I want to get through this game quick. Yeah, I know it won't be cheating, but I've just spent the last couple of days, not over the like, in a row, but the last few crucial days, I'm trying to complete this game so I can do on Titan 3. I was so close, until I realised that no sound. Fantastic, brilliant. I loved that. I loved it. I love being crushed by the fucking tower. Did I know it could happen? Nope, should be this way. Oh god. Sully, look at these stones. Ah, now we're getting somewhere. <laughs> Would you look at that? Oh, yeah. Hey. Hello. What do we have here? With any luck, the last resting place of Marco Polo's crew. Shall we check it out? Wow, this place must be thousands of years old. At least. Ah! Down this way. Wow. 
Looks like we hit the jackpot. Ugh, there must be hundreds of bodies down here. Look at their teeth. They're all black. I think they're all that way. Ah! Hey, I think I found something. In here. What? They must have carried their cargo all the way up here after they were shipwrecked. More resin. I've seen this before. Sully, give me a light. Oh. Ooh. Wait a minute. This is blood. It's everywhere. It's like a real massacre. All right, let's follow the blood stains. We'll see if they lead somewhere. Seems to end at this wall. Yeah, that's odd. Moves a little. Sully, help me out. Here we go again with the pushing. So, this game in total is going to be 10 parts. Alright? Because I've already finished it. Now, the good thing on what, I'm able, what I here. am going to be able to do with this game is Four when parts. I finish it, I'm going to be able to do. I'm going to be able to change it up a little bit of this LP. So, at the end of this. Uh, video is going to be part one and then part three because I'm going to do all of them and then edit them in a very sort of different style that I've been doing. I've wanted to do this for a while but I never do video, I never record everything and then do editing. I then t I tend to do a recording, edit that one video and then do the next and then do another video or I do a bulk of them but I never edit them all and then. So part one I've already done. So Obviously, part two will have part one and part three. So we'll have next part, previous part. I hope that makes some little bit of sense. Uh, so that's what I'm going to do. And I probably will do a similar well, thing I'm for crazy. Drake's uh, it Looks deception. like they all killed each other. You're just getting spooked. Well, I don't know. this what do we have here careful Christ <laughs> almighty <laughs> just kidding Nate you're gonna give me a goddamn heart attack oh man is that an ugly friggin thing what is it some kind of weapon no, no, it's a, a purba. It's a ritual object from Tibet. It's used to destroy obstacles. Huh? No, you know, spiritual ones. Oh. Wait a minute. Wait, could this be what Marco Polo was talking about? Kid, I don't even know what the hell you're talking about. <laughs> In his journal, he wrote that uh, the worthy seeker would be given a golden passport to conquer obstacles on the journey to Shambhala. So, what, this is it? Look, that's all really interesting, but where the hell is it a passport to? Well, maybe this map would help. Let me see that. <laughs> Between Greater India and the province of Tibet lies a field of exquisitely finished temples. Hundreds of gilded spires stretching as far as the eye can see. Hold on, I know this place. It's in Nepal. Yeah, except it's... Not just a field of temples anymore, it's a city. Well, that could make things a little more challenging. Now, hold on, there's more. In all these many temples, only one conceals the secret path to Shambhala. And that path shall only be revealed to the pilgrim who bears the golden passport. All <laughs> right, nice work, kid. So, what are we waiting for? <laughs> Let's get out of here. All right. Do you know what else See I just realized I've got to do? I've got to do the entire part, last part of the game. Um, that part of the game is just the most awkward to get through. Ugh. 
And I've got to do it all over again. The sooner I do it, the better. The sooner things will be easier. I'm going to go out and make sure the coast is clear. I'll see you in a bit. Give me a hand, Nate. Oh, God damn it. Come on. Harry, in here. It's Drake. What the hell are Get your hands up. You should know how to pick him. Shut up, Sonny. Should have known it was you. <laughs> and you, Victor Goddamn Sullivan. You still dragging this tired old sack of shit around? Easy, Nate. That's pretty ballsy for a guy who spent the last three months behind bars. Better than pissing away three months in the jungle without a clue. Found the ships, though, didn't I? You couldn't find your own ass with both hands. And a map. They came from down there. Whoa. Harry, look at this. Speaking of maps... Between India and Tibet... One temple will reveal a pathway to Shambhala. Jesus, Flynn, while we're young. Oh, well, don't be such a bad sport. Take them to Lazarevich. You're gonna wish you'd stayed in prison, mate. Move. Come on, keep moving! Oh, shit. Are you alright? Yeah, well, it'll make it look more believable. Now I'm gonna try and buy you some time. No, Chloe, you have to come with us. No. Just meet me in Nepal. Now run. Let's go. I like her. Yeah, I bet you do. They spotted us. Run for it. Watch it. Thanks for the heads up. We can quit screwing around and get up here. Let's go. Come on. Climb up. Oh, my God. Why are you going back that way? Get up there now. Run! This way. Oh, damn. Now what do we do? We jump. Oh, hold on there, son bitch. You gotta be out of your mind. We'll break our goddamn necks. If we get caught, Lazarevich will break them for us. I'm getting too old for this bullshit. Come on, now, don't you start this again. Listen, I don't have your luck. Guys like me gotta know when to walk away from the table. Sully, we're gonna get out of this, okay? We always do. Yeah. You go meet your girl in Nepal. I'm going somewhere warm. Come on. Hey, you can tell me all about it when you get back. <sighs> there they are! Oh, shit. Well, shall we? After you, Butch. See you in hell, kid. Yahoo! <laughs> <laughs> Shit. Well, when you said Lazarevich had a head start on us, you weren't kidding. Well, he's had some help from the local guerrillas. The city's been on the brink of civil war for years. He just needed to throw a little gasoline on the fire. Charming. Yeah, well, all the chaos provides some cover while he destroys the city looking for the right temple. Nate? Hello? Yeah, I'm still here. You're not having second thoughts, are you? Oh, me? Never. Good, because I'm so ready to be done with these clowns. You got a map? Uh, yeah. I'll meet you in the old market. Things are pretty quiet over there. All right, you got it. Uh-oh. We got company. Oh, great. Can you lose them? I think it might be too late for that. Come 
on. Nate, are you all right? I've been better. Half an hour to go. Chapter five. Let's try and get as much as we can of this done as possible. Go, go! Oh, he's here somewhere. Keep your eyes open. Okay, now we just gotta find Chloe. Easy, eh? Job. I was only doing this a few days ago. No way.
Seems like I am always saving your ass. Well, it is an ass worth saving. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Is that an ancient Tibetan ritual dagger in your pocket? Oh, maybe I'm just happy to see you. Hmm. <sighs> yeah, hello. So this is the key to everything. Yes, it is. Marco Polo's passport to Shambhala. What do we do with it? Ah! <laughs> I have no idea, actually. I do know Lazarevich won't get very far without it. I wouldn't underestimate him, you know. He and Flynn have been tearing this city apart. They must have leveled dozens of temples already. So what's our next move? Nate? <sighs> I hate it when you do that. <laughs> Check this out. You see the symbol? Yeah. Look up there. Okay, I see the resemblance, so what does it mean? It means we know how Marco Polo found his next clue. The temple we're looking for is going to be marked with this emblem. Now all we have to do is find it. <laughs> you do realize there are literally hundreds of these temples throughout the city. Yes, but if we found a higher vantage point... We could spot our needle in the haystack. Right. There's a hotel not far from here. <laughs> Chloe. Now is not the time. It's easily the tallest building in the city. Right. Right. Well, okay. That's, uh, that's good thinking. Follow me. Yep. All right, guys. This is where I'm going to finish this video for tonight. I am absolutely shattered. And I will be continuing this tomorrow. Probably will be trying to do it all day. I've not got anything planned for New Year, so this is probably how I'm going to spend my New Year. Basically, catching up on recording for Untried 2. So, I'm going to try and get as much as I can done tomorrow. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you when I see you.